Ring wraps. How we doing, fella? I'm good. Mate. How are you? You brought the, you brought a lure pack today. No, <laughs> no, no, no lure pack. Let's uh, just get over the Sam Jones effect yesterday. Um, you sold the fight. I don't think the fight needs selling. I just you know what it was. I walked in there and I came in peace. We all did, and then I was getting a few a few names, and I thought, well, well you've got to have it back now. So and it kind of it kind of. Uh, yeah, brought out the uh, <laughs> brought out the fun side. You, listen, you're saying the fight sells itself, but it, it, it can never have enough spice. No, probably not. But like, it doesn't genuinely. It doesn't need me to 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 sell this fight. Like, you've got Eddie there. You've got Jack and Josh with the story they have. Me and uh, Tim, the, the lawyer, and Tom, whatever his name is. We 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 don't need to sell the fight. We're just there as representatives of our fight, of our respective fighters. So your fighters. Over there, both of them. Yeah. Um, yesterday, did you have part manager, part promoter, part boxing fan, part friend hat on? Which hat did yeah, you have on? Yeah, do you know that's the best way of describing it? Because that's, I think, what I actually am. I, I, I am a boxing fan, first and foremost. Um, so I'm excited about the fight, but I'm passionate about boxing. I love it. And Jack's my friend as well. Like that, as well as, as well as, I don't want, I wouldn't say a client. He's my, he's my mate. And, there was only four of us yesterday. There was me, Jack, his missus, and Nigel Travis. That's all we went. That's all we went to to to, to Edinburgh yesterday, and it was fun. Listen, it was fun. You're gonna get stick. But Jack got a lot of love when he walked into the into the building, and then obviously it kind of switched. And um, yeah, but th th there was a few uh, name calls. Uh, you need uh, a translator at one point for the heckles. No, I didn't. I didn't actually hear some of the things that were being, that were being said. But I heard one guy. He called me. Something, and, okay. then, and then I, and then I think that's when the Lurpak comment came. But I didn't actually remember saying the Lurpak thing. I think it must have been the uh, excitement. So on the actual fight itself, um, we could talk the legs off it, like regarding the yeah. first fight, the second fight. Yeah. Obviously, you think your man won last time. You you hope and know that your man's going to win this time, as far as you're concerned. Yeah. If it's a dominant display by Jack or a shutout. Is there a trilogy in this because of the animosity no. or is it on to bigger and better things? It will be 2-0 to Jack. It depends because, listen, the reason why the fight's happening now is one, because it's the biggest payday for both men, right? It's Jack's biggest payday, it's Josh's biggest payday. If the fight's a great fight and the fans want to see it again, Jack will tell me, let's, let's, let's do it again. You have to, it's business. It's a business at the end of the day. But I think it's going to be so conclusive. The other one was conclusive. But he just ended up getting a red stain off the on the on the back of it on box rate, which shouldn't be there. He's gonna correct it this this time, and I think he's gonna win inside the distance. But if he doesn't, I couldn't really give a shit as long as you win. Just win convincingly. A lot of um, content um, creators and boxing fans put it down as one of the worst robberies in modern boxing, if not for a long time. So. Uh, how bad were the judges on that night? Or was it? Or was well, it? Listen, what, listen. We won't talk about it too much. Because I don't want to disrespect too many people. But one of the judges now is a misfits judge. So that's how shit. That, okay. That we'll leave was. that there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We don't need to talk about. We'll leave that, that anyway. there. Looking forward, even though the fighter won't do this, no. yourself as, as the boss man, who else is on the near horizon for for Catrell once he deals with Josh? Uh, to be honest with you, usually I've got an idea of a plan what we want to do, but it's in there. No, but it is in there because Josh deserves the respect of. It's him next, and it's only him. And then once we, he just, Jack has dealt with him, then we will think about what's next. But you can't, you can't do it. Uh, you can't disrespect a, no. a former undisputed champion like that and kind of look past him. You can't. You've got to look at the job, the job in hand. And lastly, knowing Jack as you do, um, how much more needle is there, and and how hu much higher is the temperature with this matchup? It's no like the. Like what I say, because of what happened, controversy sells. They don't like each other, so you don't need, again, you don't need me to spice the fight. The fight's going to be spiced anyway, but it's going to be a fantastic fight, and it's one I genuinely believe Jack's going to win and look good in it as well. Sam Jones, ring wraps. Appreciate that, brother. Thank you, bro. Nice one, bro. Ring wraps. Ring wraps.